This is Steve Liebenthal with the Idaho News 6 forecast. Had a pretty day here in southern Idaho looking out the window, blue sky, plenty of sunshine, but temperatures a lot cooler than they were yesterday. That's because a cold front came through overnight. Here's a look at those temperatures from around the region, uh, blue on those higher mountaintops indicating some cooler temperatures uh, here in the valley. Low 60s have been the rule today, 61 right now in Boise, 63 in Mountain Home, 66 in Ontario, 48 in Stanley, uh, and these temperatures slightly below average, in fact about 60 degrees cooler than average for Boise and 15 degrees cooler than it was at this time yesterday. That's how much of an effect, effect uh, that uh, cold front coming through had. As you can see, generally 10 to 15 degrees cooler today than it was yesterday uh, through most of our viewing area. It has been a breezy day and we have seen some gusts, one of 38 miles per hour in Boise so far today, a 36 mile per hour gust in Mountain Home. So a little bit chilly with that wind out there this afternoon, especially compared to yesterday. Tomorrow temperatures will start to warm. We get down to the low 40s around the valley, but sunshine throughout the day. 7 o'clock, 68 after the 3 p.m. reading of 65 there. And I think somewhere in between we're going to hit right around 70 degrees. Uh, some parts of the Treasure Valley will be even warmer than that. So slightly warmer than average tomorrow. But again, those showers moving into the Twin Falls area this evening. Again, not a lot to be concerned about, but just something to be aware of. And then sunshine dominates through Monday and Tuesday. Here's Tuesday at 5 o'clock. Clear skies for southwestern Idaho. And then the next storm system starts to approach, bringing a chance of showers by Wednesday afternoon, but the highest likelihood of those showers will be in mountain locations. So how will that impact our temperatures? Well, there you see our 74 tomorrow, 79 on Tuesday as that week quick moving system comes through. We'll cool things down on Wednesday and Thursday. By Thursday, that 69 right around average for this time of year. And after that, we warm up nicely into the mid and even upper 80s. There you see the high pressure that's dominating our weather for now, but a couple of storm systems out there. Uh, so a bit of a roller coaster, but uh, with the exception really of today, temperatures will be mostly above average. Tomorrow, just a few degrees above average, 70 in Boise, but our morning low just barely dipping down into the upper 30s. In the mountains, plenty of sunshine as well and warmer than it has been. 63 in Idaho City, a bit of a chilly start in places like McCall with a morning low of 28, but 55 is your forecast high. Chilly start in Stanley as well at 22, but a beautiful afternoon with a high temperature of 53 degrees, 61 in Fairfield, a bit breezy there. The extended forecast shows 79 on Tuesday with a cloud or two coming in as that system comes through on Wednesday. Winds will pick up, temperatures will drop, but we rebound nicely. 78 on Friday. And Madeline, Max, our director, asked if next weekend would be a good time to go fishing. And as you look at this, I think you can come up with your own answer. Awesome. That sounds fun. Well, thank you so much, Steve. You bet. It is heating up outside, but if you